Shalom, Kal Hello Allah, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Bahashim, Makar Kadash Barkata. Um, double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who will will and peace and blessings to the um elect, you know, and um you know, peace and blessings to the hopeful elect, man. Cause that that's who this video is to, man. Everybody that's a part of the hopeful elect. Everybody that is sincere in this truth, man. You know? That's who this video is for. But I got some scriptures to back up what I'm saying. But I'm gonna start off with Matthew chapter 24, verse 13. He that endured until the end, the same shall be saved. So yeah, man. You gotta endure to the end in this thing, man. You can't half that half fast do it. Do it when you feel like it. You know, you gotta endure through this, man. Endure means to, to suffer through something, man. You gotta suffer through this, man. All the way to the end, man. And guess what? We, 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 we here, man. We at the end of this thing, man. The, the, the final end is not here just yet. But it's just about here, man. We at the end of this devil Esau kingdom. We at the end of stupid two thirds living in a house of mirth. We at the end of our sufferings, man. It's just this one last round, man. And that's Jacob's trouble, man. You know? Jacob's trouble coming up with the day of the Lord on top of that, man. So, yeah, man. Just endure to the end. I can, you know, we almost out of here, man. It said, he that endure to the end, the same shall be saved. He that suffered to the end, the same shall be saved, man. You know? Um, that's another scripture. I was... Hold on, bear with me, I keep so yeah. Um quick little precept. This um this was I wasn't looking for this, but this is a good one too. I guess the spirit is about to have me bring this one out. Um this second Timothy chapter four verse two. Preach the word, be instant, in season, out of season. We prove, we brute, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. Yeah, the Lord is about long suffering, man. You know, but that beginning part said, preach this, preach the word instant, instant, instant. When you're doing something instant, you're doing it constantly, like that, man. And it say in season and out of season, cold, hot, whatever, man. Keep pushing instant. Keep being on fire. Keep, keep being, keep doing this constantly and constantly, man. You know, that's a door to the end. It say reprove, rebrute, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine, man. Yeah, we, we brother's supposed to get on our ass. We supposed to get on brother ass, you know. Supposed to keep each other up, man. You know. And ultimately, Yahweh shot gonna keep us up from falling, man. If we are part of that number, you know. You know, whatever happens, don't. Don't don't let go. Don't let go, man. Just 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 keep holding on and keep on, um, you know, suffering in this truth, man. Keep enduring in this truth, man. Um, I got that. All right. I got a. You know, I'm gonna pull that one out later. All right. Now my original scripture I wanted. This Ecclesiasticus or Sharat, chapter four, verse twenty-eight. For the truth, strive for the truth unto death, and the Lord shall fight for thee. So yeah, strive unto this truth unto death, man. Strive until you die, man. Strive, man. Strive. I'm going to read it back. I'm going to read it back. This Sharak chapter 4 verse 28. Strive for the truth unto death, and the Lord shall fight for thee. So yeah, man. And that, word, that word strive means... Um, Hold on, bear with me. It means to devote serious effect or energy. That's why right. you gotta give out a, a, a certain energy in this thing, man. And since I said that, hold on, I'm gonna hold that, but let me get this precept out real quick. This Ecclesiastes, this Ecclesiastes, chapter 9, verse 10. 
It say, whosoever thy hand findeth to do, do it with all thy might. And that's the point that I needed, you know. Who, 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 if your hand, your hand found to do this truth, do it with all thy might, man, you know. Take it and run with it. Do it with all thy might, you know. Don't, ha when you want to, when you want something, what you do? You take it, you, you know. Take this truth and do it if you really want it, man, you know. Um, so back to that definition for that word strive is say to devote serious or effort so like it, to the to devote serious effort or energy. Why well, you gotta give out a strong energy in this man? And it's more in that definition. Oh my phone. Hold on, so like it's saying this shit. We gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep enduring through this video. It say to finish a project. Yeah, this a project, man. Well what of this project we trying to build the house of David man we trying to we, we trying to build up the house of David we trying to start start the um build the foundation of the kingdom of heaven man that's in the near future man this, this the project the Lord got us doing so yeah you gotta like I said to finish a project yeah don't build a tower and finish it and, and um don't finish it man you know hold on I gotta pull that out so like it, the scripture just, just it, it's this other scripture I wanted to pull out, but I can't, I can't really think of it, but I'm going to pull that out. You know, if the Lord put the spirit on me to find that, or, um, or if he don't want the spirit on me to bring it out, I ain't going to bring it out. This is Luke chapter 14, verse 28. For which of you intending to build a tower, sit of not down first and count up the cost, rather he have sufficient to finish it so yeah before you even adore this truth before you even um do anything um for this truth you gotta think about it before you do it because you don't know what you're getting yourself into you gotta think about what you're getting yourself into but like, all right okay like nobody so for example um i can't nobody ain't just build this playground i'm at right now also you know what we're just gonna wake up today and build a playground. No, they had to think about how they was gonna do it, how was they gonna start the foundation, the um perimeter of it, the measure. You know, they had to think about where they gonna put it at. You know, before they actually built it. That's how you gotta be when you come in this truth, man. You know, you gotta count that cost, man. Then when you do, you gotta finish it, man. You can't just all right. So like, say, say they built this playground. They only built the swings over there and um these rocks right next to me. And that's it. You they ain't finish it, man. You gotta finish the whole playground, man. You gotta finish that tower. You got you build that tower, you count the cost, now you gotta finish it, man. And part of finishing it is enduring it to the end, man. You know? Um back back to that Ecclesiasticus. This Shirak chapter four verse twenty-eight. Um strive for the truth unto death. And the Lord shall fight for thee. So yeah, striving this truth to death, the Lord go fight for you, man. The Lord go fight your battles for you, man. We don't need. It's no need to get carnal in this, man. You know. Okay, of course, of course brothers make mistakes, even including myself. You might get carnal or whatever, but at the end of the day, you know, pray to the Lord, forget about it, and stay spiritual, man. If if, if you in that situation and strive for this truth, man, get back on this truth, man. Leave that bullshit in the past and get back on this truth and keep going, man. You know, if, if you go through a trial tribulation like that or any trial tribulation, put that, push that out the way, you know, and keep going, man. Get, if you fall, get right back up, man. Keep moving, man. It's, I'm going to read that definition for strive again. It says to devote serious effort or energy to finish a project. So, yeah, man. This is serious effort or energy, man. It's not no game, man. So, be on your serious stuff. Be a man and um, finish this project, man. It's another definition. Say to struggle and pos in opposition. So yeah, you you gotta. That goes with the suffering. You 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 coming with all your energy. You finish this project, but while you in the midst of doing that, you struggling through it, man. This ain't gonna be no easy road. That's that's the whole point of striving for this truth, man. I'm pretty sure when they um when they built their playground, they had they had a couple um you could say obstacles or whatever. They probably um had to move some shit, dig in some more, you know, to start the foundation to keep the um part stable. They had to buy this stuff, you know. 
that's your, that's to, that that's that's your trials and your, your tribulations you go to. Get that, all right. Knock that out the way and keep going, man. Don't stop, man. Keep going. So yeah, man. It's Shirak once again. Shirak chapter four verse twenty eight. Strive for the truth unto death, and the Lord shall fight for thee. So yeah, man. Strive in this truth, endure to the end. The Lord go fight for you, man. Whoever come against you, the Lord go fight for you, man. And that goes back for be, to being spiritual, man. The Lord is going to fight for you, man. You know, you 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 just gotta do what He wants you to do. You you just gotta play your part and a part play your part in the deal, man. You know, he's he's he he says, strive in this truth, keep going in this truth, keep enduring in this truth, keep struggling. You know. Uh, come with that same em energy Then I'm gonna fight for you man That's that that that's all the Lord's saying You know And he will fight for you You know Shit The Lord the one who put you through that temptation Um Okay Since I said that Um I'm gonna close out It's Titus chapter 2 verse 7 and all things showing thyself a pattern of good works yeah you might be like how you um how do I strive in the truth what, what do I do for the Lord you show them works man you know like in um um second Ezra the um ninth chapter you know talk about we're gonna be saved through our works man you know one of, that's one of the verses. But anyway, it say in doctrine showing uncorruptness, gravity, sincerity. So yeah, you gotta be sincere with this. You gotta come like 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 that one scripture I just brought out in um Timothy's man. You gotta come with long suffering doc doctrine, man. You know, you gotta endure to this endure to the end. You can't cause yourself to be corrupted, man, you know. You gotta keep going through your um don't going through your temptations. Don't let your temptations um don't don't let your sins weigh you down or don't let your temptations t tempt you, you know. Um and it say Oh yeah, gravity is sincerity. You gotta be sincere, man. If you if you endure to the end, if you striving for the truth and to death, you being sincere, man. Because only a sincere person will do that, you know. A sincere so somebody that's about their word, man. Man, it ain't word, you know. But yeah, man. I ain't want to make this video too long. It's it's way more scriptures I could I could bring out, but I'm just gonna close out right here. But with that, I'm going to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Bahashim, Makah, Kadash, Barakata. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who um, taught us this truth. And um, peace and blessings to the whole four elect, man. This video is for y'all, man. Keep enduring, man. Keep striving for this truth, man. And with that, Abad, Babor, Shalom.